Welcome to Guns and Gear Network, everyone. Thank you for tuning in today. Today we are working on our FJ Cruiser, the bug out vehicle project, and we're trying to add some shackle attachments. So if you're familiar with the ARB bumper that's for FJ Cruisers, they do not have recovery points anywhere on the front other than just where your winch is. They don't have a spot dedicated for bow shackles. Um, so that's the issue I have with this bumper. Now, from the factory, the FJ has two recovery spots and they're okay, but uh, I do like a recovery point on the bumper itself. So there's a way to add those. And so I got to researching around, trying to find a good supplier for those and what would work. And I found a guy on eBay that goes by the username Snyder1976. And I'll post in the section below down there where I found his information and where his store is on eBay. But I reached out to him and asked would he like to participate in our project and he agreed to do that. And that's greatly appreciated. So what we're going to do, I'm going to do a couple videos. This video I'm just kind of showing you uh, what I'm doing and what's going on. I'm going to show you the product itself. So these are the shackle attachment points that he sells. He's got a few different variations and sizes and styles. Um, but this one here, if you look, the quality of these are excellent. Just real nice machining. Uh, he bevels the edge so it doesn't have sharp edges or anything like that. The uh, They come either with backer plates or with not without. I decided to get backer plates and just to kind of reinforce everything a little better. And that's what I went with. So if you look, these things are really nice. They're about one inch in thickness. Um, let's see here. Yeah, they're about one inch thick and uh, just super nice, really nice clean welds and so forth. Uh, he's got them where they've got this squared off look. And then he's got some that are rounded, whatever. Just kind of go to his store and look around. And of course, these are made in the good old USA and it's stamped right there on it. And that's nice. I like supporting small mom and pop type businesses that uh, really kind of, they understand the industry of particular whatever they're uh, doing. So like if it's off-roading, they usually are an off-road enthusiast that kind of do this as a hobby and um, they uh, make products. So that's why I like supporting those type folks. But I want to thank Snyder1976 for sending these out. That was greatly appreciated. And like I said, I'll put in the section below down there where I got them. So let me show you where I'm going to put these on the ARB bumper. It's kind of limited. Um, I saw one person on the internet put one here and one here. And that's okay. That's not too bad. Um, not that it matters, but it would cover up my ARB sticker. Um, possibly here but that gets a little difficult in having i'll probably have to take my whole bumper off to do that um, down here it would actually work fine the problem is you're getting away from the structural integrity of the center portion here where it's attached to the frame so that concerned me um, you could i could mount them here just on top like that i didn't think that looked all that great but i was actually washing my fj this morning and i noticed a spot down here right here and i think it'll work perfect i've tested i can get the backer plate inside of that little area there and i think i can get them mounted right there and that'll work really well they're kind of out of the way but yet you know kind of look cool uh down there and then i can have my bow shackles hanging off of it i just think it'll look nice but that's what we're going to do um i've cleaned these now that i've handled them i'll have to clean them again uh, but i've cleaned these with alcohol and i'm getting ready i've prepped them and i'm getting ready to uh paint them and then once i get everything painted up and mounted and stuff like that i'll show you a final video of how it turned out but uh anyway guys i appreciate you tuning in again i want to thank snyder 1976 on ebay for sending these out for us for the project that's greatly appreciated as always guys if you got any questions you can post those below if you like our videos give us a thumbs up that's always appreciated also the share buttons down there that helps us get the word out about guns gear network which is also greatly appreciated as always guys like share and subscribe bring another video shortly have a great day